open, you can still go catch red snapper. Only on certain boats though. And a lot of people are a little confused, angry, upset. But keep in mind, there's some benefits to our private recreational red snapper season that FWC and Governor Ron DeSantis put together for the private recreational anglers. Remember for red snapper, recreational anglers like me and like you are split because of the management structure. So if you're fishing on a federally permitted for hire vessel, meaning if you're going into federal waters offshore and you're fishing on a charter boat or party boat, with money exchanging hands, there has to be a federal permit involved. And that federal permit season for Red Snapper is June 1st through end of day, August 24th. So here at Hubbard's Marina on our boats, you can catch Red Snapper until August 24th. Across the Gulf, Brownsville, Texas, Port, Port Aransas, Galveston, up in Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, the Panhandle, Destin, not so great, but it is a Red Snapper fishing destination. You can catch Red Snapper on party boats and party boats at party boats and charter boats all the way through end of day august 24th but keep in mind if you're on your own private boat or a buddy's private boat no money is exchanging hands that's a private recreational red snapper trip you guys have something great to look forward to that we don't get now the state of florida what they've done is they've decided to allow private recreational red snapper fishermen to end the season July 31st. So private recreational red snapper is over now, but there is weekend extension. So the month of October and the month of November, every weekend, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, you're gonna be able to catch red snapper and keep them, and we will not. So during gag grouper season, which opens September 1st and runs through November 10th, you're gonna be able to go out there the whole month of October and the first week of November, five weekends in a row, and catch red snapper and gag grouper and keep both. Whereas if you're fishing on a charter boat or party boat in the Gulf of Mexico, you'll only be able to keep those gags. So the private recreational red snapper season is closed early, uh, earlier than our federal for hire season. Our season is still open through end of day, August 24th. We can still go catch red snapper, but this fall, when gags open, you'll be able to go out there on a private boat and keep gags and red snapper, we will not. So it's just a little bit of a different season structure. It gets a little confusing, but in my opinion, for private recreational anglers, it gives you more options, right? Uh, that's a positive way of looking at it, I guess, and maybe I'm looking at it through rose-colored glasses, but hey, if you're a private guy, you could book a charter or go on a party boat for the first 24 days of August and catch a red snapper. And then come October, you'd be able to go out there on the weekend, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday and get red snapper and gag grouper in your own private boat too. So you got the best of both worlds if you so choose, or just wait and take advantage of it on your own private boat, whatever you want. But don't forget, down at Don's Dock, we got all your bait, fuel, and ice. So for private recreational red snapper season and really any any day, you can come on down to John's Pass at Hubbard's Marina and Don's Dock, and you can grab your fuel, bait, and ice from Don's Dock. And if you're not a fisherman, but you wanna catch some red snapper for your plate, you can go on down to Don's Dock where we have our commercial retail market. You'll be able to buy some red snapper and take them home and eat them. So catch them yourself during one of these open seasons. Come on down to our fresh seafood market where we have fresh fish landed daily from commercial vessels. We retail that fresh fish fresh off the boat at Don's Dock. Plus, we have live bait, we have fuel, we have ice, we have shrimp. So all those options down at Don's Dock too. So even if you're not booking a trip with us, even if you've got your own private boat, you can still come on down and join us at Hubbard's Marina. Don't forget our website has those weather links. We got lots of helpful fishing regulation stuff. And tune into our Sunday night live stream show every Sunday night where we explain more about what's going on now, what we're catching, what we're seeing, what's going on in the water, and talk about the weather and more. So hopefully, you'll get a chance to come out and join us. We've got super light loads, August starting like the second week of August, the third week of August, all the way through Red Snapper again, doesn't close to the end of the day, August 24th. We've got 39 hour trips. The 39 hour this coming Sunday has 17 people on it. We're going and we've got 17 people, super light loads and Red Snapper season is still open. So you've got lots of fish to catch, plus trigger fish just reopened, amberjack is open. There's tons of fish to go out there and catch. We're seeing a lot of vermilions, yellowtails, a handful of muttons. We're getting big mangrove snapper. It's a great time to get out there. The 12 hour extremes crushing, big scamp, big vermilion, big red snapper. 
and um, some nice mangroves too. So great opportunities, plenty of fish, super light loads. It is just, it's a little, it's a little hot. It might be a little hot. The weather is good, fishing is good. Get out there on the water where the bite is hot and uh, it's a full moon right now. So plenty of water is moving and those fish are chewing. So hopefully we'll see you down here. Don't forget, like I said, red snapper season for us continues through end of August, uh, end of day, August 24th. And uh, red gag grouper opened up September 1st through November 10th. We've got plenty of other fish to catch. We got scam grouper open all year, mangrove snapper open all year. We're seeing a lot of yellowtails. We're seeing some good muttons. We're seeing plenty of fish, vermilions, porgies, almacos. Uh, we're seeing some fat scamp groupers. So lots of fish to go out there and catch. Hopefully we'll see you out there on the water. If you're a private recreational angler, yes, the red snapper season closed July 31st, but you've got those weekends coming up that we won't be able to take advantage of come October and November. Hopefully this made sense. Hopefully it helped you understand a little bit more about what's going on with the red snapper in the Gulf of Mexico. And hopefully we'll see you out there on the water because don't forget, if you're too busy to go fishing, you're just too darn busy.